Koy sıra anlık sabahına kaymayın. Eksa diyor. I'm not actually really sure, but hey, we see the game has actually started. We see Reyna picking the priest to start, and Malazak using the druid. Wow. Do you like it against the aggro priest to start the game? I think it's fine. I think it's fine, but hey, Malazak is one step ahead. It shows a very good matchup for this. Look at that. Four attack, five health. Oh. It's, it's, oh my, okay. okay I, I, I just wanted to say. Are you happy with this hand now? I'm, I'm happy with this hand okay. right now. I'm super happy. I mean, like, I, I'm super happy if I'm lasting because if I vouch for Reynald, I'm super sad right now. Oh wow, that curve though. What, oh, what is happening? And you really want what? to play those minions play, early? Play the spider on Reynald, I don't like it. No, You don't like playing spider? You don't like playing spider? Mm -mm. Oh, why wow. not? Logan is not proof, guys. Okay, Logan is the druid expert. Logan, wh why do you don't like this, this spider? I find it really weak. As a draw. Okay. I prefer to play like a golem. A golem? Yeah. It's a, so, but it's a two drop. Do you like Sand Fury instead? Or I, just no I two drops? Know. Just skip it? You can just play Hero Power as Druid. Okay. Oh, you mean like you don't like the spider overall? The spider overall. Oh, oh my god, overall. look at this curve. Yeah, look at that curve. Oh my god, I would play easily, I would play the Spectral. You, play, Spectral, you just slam the Spectral. Just slam it. Yeah, slams, slams. Actually, that's really good. Like we can see from his, um, from uh, Reyna's hand, it's gonna be a, um, but what playmaster, you, right? What's the follow up? Like you, you slam. That's okay. You slam the structure and then the wrap is the follow up. Yeah, wrap and gear power. Power. I like that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you agree with you? Wow. Very nice. Okay, so yeah, now because, you know the matchup. Uh, Saint is really weak. He can't do anything against the board. Of okay. Uh, okay, makes sense. Okay, not not yet, not, not yet. Is that it's free mana, and uh, what you can do here is you, you play injured blade master, or you can try some shenanigans with uh, power shield. Yeah, power shield. No, just no, no, forget about the power. That's a power master for now, right? Yeah. It's really important, no especially for stuff. like yeah, no yeah. fancy stuff. Yeah, the only thing yeah. in the red was just. Oh, we we're seeing the decks right now, guys. Oh man, uh, there is a black knight on the druid side. Yep, so Samsung, Druid is Black Knight Tech. No Savannah, just the Black Knight. Right. And on the left side, we see, once again, no 79 drops, just the micro drop, but we see a Black Knight as well. So double Cabal, Black Knight. What's below uh, the Black Knight? It's Mike, a micro control, yeah. Mike it's purple. Ball, yeah. Yeah. It's pinkish, purplish, yeah, it looks like that. Yeah, and only that, one Holy yeah. Nova, so that's the cut. So the Holy Nova turned into a Black Knight instead. So there you go. And he has one Golden Northshire Cleric and one regular Northshire Cleric. Just to make the list huge. <laughs> what so does it really even mean? Well, it just means that you know which one you drew. Would you say that one of them is a golden lady he has? Hmm. Not really. Yeah, so uh, here, I think the power shield is better because um, the blade master would be terrible. Oh, you're right. I actually agree with that. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go for some uh, cute play here. It's actually gonna get uh, rewarded a little bit. Uh, the, the um. I mean, you want to have Cabal Shadow Priest, so it's good that he has one. Yeah. Uh, in case of like uh, Keeper of the Grove, he actually gets rewarded for it. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. better to get it earlier because then Druid will play around it. All right, I like this play. I like this. This is super. Uh, but yeah, we can cycle the Raph here, which is pretty good. What? 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 Just what, what? Wait. Okay. Logan. Okay. Logan. Okay. Logan. No, no, no. What? That has happened. That... What was yeah, that? I, I would. No, I don't know. I, don't know. I, I mean, the play was fine, but what happened with Raph? Like, <laughs> yeah, he could draw just. He afraid of three dam uh, two damage. He afraid of three two, two, two damage. In his face. Well, I don't like that. Yeah, it was really bad. Now oh. he's like out of cards, and he if he don't have an innervate, he won't play Lord soon. Wait, w would you guys actually like cycle the? <laughs> oh my <laughs> Jesus! Wow. Dex not still double double force of nature. Double force of nature. And that's yes. the dream. Alright, but wow. Okay, so it looks sick, but it's actually not because he's behind. Yeah, he's yeah. behind. You can't use savage roll on your. You will never have both to use it. Yeah. Well, I guess you can use a second. And that's forward. something that Brian Kibler would be happy about. Like, this proves Brian Kibler's point. What, I mean, what? he actually like replied to us on Twitter. And what did he say? About, like, Thought Steel. Uh, yeah. Well, because we said that Brian says that Thought Steel is oh, not okay. a good card. I can actually like, read his tweet. Oh, man. Uh oh. Yeah. But hey, here Savage Roar can at least remove the uh, remove the uh, special knife, which is not bad. Yeah, you just say that uh, Thought Steel is an overrated card because when you get a good stuff, you're just really excited and you feel that the yeah. card is good. But. When you get bad stuff, you're like, okay, whatever. Yeah, it's not that bad. You, 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 you get, get bad stuff, it's not get, that bad. You get never get bad stuff, except you get like two deadly poison. Deadly poison, blade furries, you know. But that's really the limit of that. Yeah, yeah. And the possibilities is that you will get two good cards because government 
It's your same level like you plays a good deck, so he got... <laughs> you're time. assuming that your opponent plays a bad deck, which is not that good. Okay, guys, last minute comment from Brian, from, uh, Brian, Brian Kibler from the Brian Kibler organization. Okay, okay. He says, it's good in controlling decks against other control decks for sure, just not a must play. Okay. So he agrees that uh, in a control deck... I player, find it the I must find. play against everything. Well, in the, in the uh, Death Rider Priest, uh, it, it was pretty successful without running it. And yeah. I guess it, it fits the theme of the deck, right? Well, the the the, the, yeah. the more end game heavy the deck is, the better it falls to it. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yes. Um, but Sylvanas here is going to be um, pretty annoying here. Oh. Pretty annoying. I would just lord and go face. You just slam the lore? Yeah, and okay, go slam face. The okay. You have to close, which is a lot of reach. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. And with. Uh, Two combos, with, so he runs two combos. Mm -hmm. You have high possibility to draw something with uh, Lord now. Okay, but the thing is that you don't really want to play the Age of Lord because you can, you can see like, oh, Sylvanas is gonna kill it, and then he's gonna steal a creature. You know? Still, you have yeah, yeah. Still, he will get thirty points. Wait, so so what do you do? Like, just you just play the cat and go face? No, he just wants to play Lord. I would play Lord. I would just play Lord and go. Which is reasonable, right? I think it's really. Reasonable. And what what if you just go face for? Oh, I mean, you don't have to attack with. Um, shade, brother. But we saw a lot of. Um, what if you do? Ooh. Like, go like. Okay, that's a YOLO. That's how, how much damage is that? I. You don't like this? I like it. It's, I like it. it's, it's, it's like the same play, man. You can play. You can play the card this turn or the next turn. It's like the same thing. Don't you force your like because your opponent has to clear the board and he will have to heal at the same time. Well, it's a pretty easy Holy Nova to me. Well, so, just... The Holy Nova doesn't accomplish much. Actually, is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. And he's dead. Well, wow, that's he's a good play, then, right? I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. but there you go. Know, he didn't play the Fire Monster going, and stuff. He going for face with cats, it's always good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's always good, of course, especially if you have two cats. Yeah. You gain uh, so much. Right. There you go. Well, we did see a game before that it, it was lost because they, he didn't innovate that inch of lore. <coughs> Remember yeah. that game? Yeah. So I guess uh, you, you gotta be careful if you don't want to play lore. But here you go, uh, Malazi actually wins. This, yeah, uh, that's it. Part. That's exactly so there you go. That, that's pretty really nice. Pretty well played. All right, so Reyna will have to, uh, um, you know, change it. Uh, by the way, I want to I want to pause here for a moment and oh, okay. uh, and explain this to Vanus, By the way, so sometimes in Hearthstone. When, when somebody plays a card that's really hard to deal with, mm -hmm. in this situation, you just ignore the card. You just yeah, go around just, it. Like, you just ignore it. So you don't have... Any part of the combo wins the game. Mm -hmm. You run two off, both. And with uh, that, you risk the possibility to have a belter or something, because you can't pass it okay. by. Even though if you play lore and all this mess up happens, you still have the five cards Instead of the two he had now. Yeah. Because you draw. Okay. So Edge of Lore was also uh, pretty good. It was reasonable. Yeah. Uh, both were reasonable, I think. Both yeah. was reasonable, yeah. yeah. So guys, if you, if you don't know, like, Logan is uh, our Druid so specialist yeah. from, from yeah, Greece. Oh, oh, here's, here's a question for you, Logan, okay? Yeah. How does the Druid match up against a YOLO warrior? Uh, it wins. It wins? Yeah. It, it wins? just wins? It just wins? Uh, it just wins. Hands down? Wow. Yeah, oh, wow. Well, uh, but if you're not running Tons, like if you're not running some Fury, but you're in Content Creeper. Well, you, <laughs> you, 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 can just clear the board with uh, silence. I mean, uh, Groove just uh, counters every card this deck has because you mm. have st stuck in uh, Berserkers and buffing. Okay, and it just dies, right? Yeah. So, like swipes and rafts and stuff like that. No, it's just more damage on Druid side. Oh, more damage. Okay, and okay. how did you like the play with the Innervate uh, Spectral? Yeah, Innervate Spectral. Yeah. Like, I, I was thinking of coining a shade and then getting a Spectral instead. Yeah, it's uh, equally good. They're both equally good. Uh, but uh, he can't bypass the Spectral. He has to oh, yeah. hit it with, uh, like, he has to waste yeah. seven damage. But here he can actually ask and use the Corsair um, as a play, as a possible play. Now, well, why is the five points of damage? Oh no, you mean of course, okay, you oh, just axe the yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Sure, sure. Or I guess if you want to remove the knight, you just use hero strike. No, so. not this turn. Oh no, yeah, The problem with that kind of decks against Druid is that uh, they have eventually to waste damage to trade. On the creatures. Eh? On creatures before, on creatures. because a three, any three creatures Druid have with the Savage it can be lethal any time, even at fifth okay. turn. 
Okay, yeah, it makes sense. So it's a like counterintuitive strategy because you want to go face, but uh, you're forced to trade. Yeah, so yeah. you're basically. That's why Adam is strong against trade because half freezing up, which ignores you. Right? Yeah. Eight minutes. Okay. Yeah. You've been talking about no good plays, but I think that was a really solid trade play, play from Reina. Yeah, he just trades here four four. Uh, it's three mana. You can't really um. Yeah, yeah he just do that. But the thing is, like, you are you are wasting damage on like you know minions to minions. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But but that was. Solid. Probably the best. That was probably the best. Yeah, I agree with that. By the way, guys, it's like uh, it's a face warrior. Come on, like there we go. That was the face attack. I like that. Yeah, but I mean, like how crazy it is. Like yeah. warrior is such a strong deck, like a control warrior, and here we see the the face warrior. Yeah. Well, you have to justify to yourself that you know this deck has to be better than a control warrior, right? I mean, why would you not play a better, a worse deck just for the surprise factor? Because you're only surprised for like one game, right? Everybody knows your deck after that first one game. Maybe because you have a free bump format. Huh. So like you put yourself in a situation where this, this deck is actually better than a control warrior. Okay, okay. Interesting. Yeah. Also, right now is the kind of person that said that he's gonna ban a warlock every game. Every game. So he probably tested out matchups. He knows the better classes are gonna get picked if he bans warlock. Oh yeah, Zoo is really good against this deck. Of course. <laughs> yeah. And, and then so after the two classes are chosen, he can ban the decks that are unfavorable against okay. this specific deck. So I think that's his mindset. Yeah, that's this, very smart. Yeah. This deck, I think, can win with two more like, can win easily against Handlock. Okay. Because even if he don't up, you have like 12 damage burst. Mm. And you can force your hit point low by hitting a uh, giant. Okay. Well, it's it's hard to see, right? It's hard to see if you're not playing this Don't you think like you'll be just running out of steam? I mean, with, right this, with this deck, you just... Draw well, into I don't know like seven eight cards yeah. and then you're done like you have those the, the fourteen or thirty cards left. It seems exactly, pretty to easy to be done really quickly. That's for sure. Okay, so he's just gonna you know whirl in the bit here. Um, we know that his board is probably gonna get cleared. Um, and then he's out of steam. He's out of steam, but he's holding um eight damage possible ten. And there are no taunts, so uh, I I would clear the board with uh, uh, force. Yeah. The force. Yeah. Uh, it's, I, I like well, that actually. Yeah, you can use you can use keeper too, I guess. Huh? I mean, attacking with the weapon was really painful because it opens up the keeper of the grove. So yeah, it does. But it was kind of necessary uh, because right? he has to push for damage every yeah. turn, especially that uh, Masi can map taunts on the board. <laughs> wow. Wow. How much damage is that? Oh, that's twelve. Twelve damage. Eleven. Eleven. What? And what? Then Eleven? How's it? Eleven. Fifteen. It's four. Four plus right? three. What, how, no, oh no! I mean, all, 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 his whole hand, his whole has twelve damage. Oh, I was, oh, yeah, 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 I was yeah, yeah. calculating yeah, yeah, yeah. weapon right, 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 right. strikes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, I was calculating all the heroic strikes. Yeah, that's that a really weird, ha weird hand to have. And that's why, that's the reason why I don't like this spider. At the moment, just one damage. No, dude, this spider is a massive. It's like I, I play a spider, and it's like it's crazy. It's one damage in one turn, but then three turns, it's three points of damage. Wow. Yeah. That's pretty good. Most, times, most of the times I want to ignore this uh, card because it's actually double its damage. If you kill because it. you're a druid. Double damage if you but kill it, right? But exactly. If you're playing yeah. a different yeah. class, it's actually really annoying to deal with. Yeah. It is annoying to deal if with. If you're playing a paladin, it's much. killing your dudes. Oh, that's a good draw. Oh, he can actually that's heal. Yeah, it's a huge draw. Yeah, that's, that's a huge draw. He can, he can actually heal here. Yeah. Oh, he, oh, to he decides place. to go for yeah. I'm not sure about that. Oh, I'm, I'm sure oh, that's, that's the best play. That's the best play. That's the best play. That's, that's, the, best play. that's, that's the best play. That's really the, the best play. Very good job. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much damage <laughs> is this then? You probably... It's too much. Guys, that uh, name is too much. But it's, yeah, it's okay. over. It's over. It's over. No, it's if you count down the damage, the mo he can't reach 70 damage in a turn with four cards. Yeah, there's no way. Yeah, okay, uh, okay. I mean, 17, you can't buy four. Yeah, but it's over like... Oh, warrior can't buy four. The, the, yeah. the Druid actually goes um, here. Right. Well, too bad. We yeah. want to see some uh, Yolo Warrior action, but it seems like the Yolo Warrior is going to... I don't find it. Oh my god. It. I don't find it. Is this, is this happening, guys? Is, yeah. is Reyna on the brink of elimination right now with the Reyna Force of Nature and Sajor? It's one game away from getting out of the tournament. Oh, Can Reyna do it, Colento, and have a comeback with yeah. three wins in a row? Well, I mean, it's not just the. It's just not an elimination, right? It's like the first invited player to get out. Yeah. 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 Reyna was saying that he has really terrible luck. Wow, look at that. Oh, look at the drag. Oh, yeah, I, well, to be honest, if you play a deck like that with zero draw engine and you just 
play with your top deck, eh, you like way too much some luck. This is my okay. biggest. This okay. is my biggest problem. Terrible. Yeah, it's a pretty Le good analysis. Le Leopard Nymph is never terrible. It's a good card. <laughs> I mean, I'm not She's... saying that Leopard Nymph is terrible. I'm just saying that. Well, the top deck in it. It turned out. In this scenario, oh, okay. Oh. Any card he could top deck, he would lose in the game because so far that way. But hey guys, let's focus on this game. Uh, uh, Reyna's last hope is this Shaman deck. <laughs> he needs to win this game and two more. Shaman is a deck alive. that actually can win three games in a row. Yep. yep. It's, it's very flexible. Well, the thing is, he can actually change deck after. Well, actually, so, to be know. super honest, mm -hmm. Shaman is a deck that can win you eight games in a row and can win you 100,000. 11 games. 11, was 11, was it 11 games? 11, no. That's yeah. just insane. And we are. Uh, talking about WCA, Libo the winner, one hundred thousand uh, dollar yeah. winner. One hundred thousand dollars. I play Shaman for one hundred thousand dollars. Well, yeah, you have absolutely. to do like win eleven games in a row. With that's it. true. That, that's a tall order. So, like, the question is if Reynad is able to do it and win eleven games in a row. Wait, three, three is fine. Three is fine. Yeah. But let's 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 do. You know. If he wins eleven games in a row with the Shaman deck, mm -hmm. he wins the tournament. Okay. I, I just want Reynad to win this tournament because he promised me to get the, the cup and fill it with salt if he does. Whoa, so you are a Reynad missionary. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, you have tights. So can someone get him out of here? No. <laughs> well, actually, you don't need biased, um, you know. Actually, if he loses this here. game, he might fill the, the cup with oh, salt. Oh, anyway. guys, guys, definitely. Alright, so we know what Malazic is playing, but over at Reynad's side, we see Harrison Jones. There is no Doomhammer? We see Harrison guys, Jones I, I instead have, of Doomhammer. I have exactly Unbound. the same list for some reason. One Lightning Storm, really? One Lightning Storm? I, I don't have no Ruby Next. Unbound Elemental. Okay, is, okay. Why is, is, is Un Unbound Elemental back in Shaman? Unbound Elemental. Yeah. It's actually pretty good. It on control decks. Now that meta, it's a bit more control than. Yeah, it's a it's big threat. Yeah. It was gone, yeah. right? Like, it was gone. Yeah, yeah. Was because there's only Miracle Rocks that uh, two shot people and. Uh, it destroyed it. Yeah. yeah. So far. It... Exactly, exactly. But now it's completely fine. It's like a Dark Cultist, really. It's just one less attack. Who cares? You just buff it up yourself. Okay, so uh, we see a Shaman side here. Uh, overload because of the uh, Spirits, of course. You have two mana to work with. Uh, you could use both your ones. I mean, it doesn't look good. So I'm, I'm pretty sure that you just sacrifice the totem and you totem. Oh, you totem up first because you don't want the steering. Totem up first. Yep. Then you see what happens. You don't want the steering totem again. Whoa. Oh, you don't totem up. You just. Oh, you just go flame tong and kill it and go face. Okay. Well. Okay. So basically, this matchup, <coughs> Shaman oh. versus Druid, is about board presence. Like Shaman All is about always. Board. A, but you just ignore dealing damage. Exactly. You just want to keep the board. Mm -hmm. Can you overextend? Someone needs only two things to win with Druid. Okay. Spirit is a fellow spirit and a healing totem. A healing totem? Okay. Because, yeah. because you can like swipe escape the swipe. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you can swipe. Okay. It's the only removal Druid. That's, That's a pretty, pretty good insight. Okay. So you swipe here, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> of course. Okay. Actually, you can... You can loathe... Uh, okay. Can you wrath? You can wrath uh, the totem uh -huh. and... Hero power, the wolf, and keep, oh, uh, and keep the swipe. Keep the swipe for something big, especially if you have okay. Thalnos or Azur in your deck. Okay. It's better to keep your swipe. I agree. I mean, uh, I agree. Sometimes it just happens that your opponent has a big board and he will totem on the board there, so swiping doesn't get you much value. Oh, yeah, you're so, right. right? Because if he has a healing totem, then swipe is losing value, so you just use it right away. Yeah, know? so. Yeah, yeah but if you. Right I now, think he runs Azur and Thalnos. Okay. So, so then Swipe has more exponential value. Yeah. Okay. Also, Swipe is like a threat that you're playing around. It's like, if you know that Swipe is out of the way, you can just overextend it. Yeah, you're like, true. yeah, whatever. In my opinion, Swipe as card is the worst value in the game, the worst in the first class. But with Longstone Power, it's become like... It's crazy. The best AoE in the game. Oh my god. Yeah, it's, <laughs> two, oh, it's like Consecration plus a uh, wrath. Hammer of Wrath. Yeah, uh, wrath yeah it's pretty sick. Okay. Um, yeah, two unbounds, but no really uh, any overloads. Yeah, so that's kind of awkward. But if you check the someone had Reynolds, he have like a uh, full combo. If you want to fire, oh man, he doesn't do seven more damage. At, uh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, seven. Yeah, yeah, he needs to do seven more damage on Druid, and that kind of Druid, Nyol's uh, playing, it's the Druid without real dodge from the close. Okay. And kind of war yeah, so he will stop that right now. He will be able to explode. Oh, the Skittles again. Oh, the spider. The yeah. Spider. Yeah, great card. Yeah. <laughs> you just hated it. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's 
It's just useless. It just one damage. In 20 turns, it will deal 20 points of damage. Yeah, I, I actually count this card while the hand, Hunter Ladder is popular played for Ladder. But okay. in a tournament to play, to counter what? Counter play to, to kill what? You well, maybe can I, I you have can kill the frogs. I just yeah. have the same mindset. I mean, Magma Rager, that card just kills it in six turns. I, I've seen I've seen your video on Magma Rager. You, oh. you, you tried to play. You tried really hard. You tried really hard. That was good. I failed though. You, you, you didn't fail. <laughs> I mean, the video was good. Like the, you, you didn't fail on the video. A for effort. Mm -hmm. Anyways, uh, Lothar is going to come down here. I'm pretty sure it's going to be mirrored. Um, if Melasic doesn't draw anything, you know. Better. Oh wow, there is, <laughs> there is a healing totem. I think mm -hmm. Lothar is the best answer to Lothar. Usually, it's like that, right? Usually, yeah, because like it's right. Like, right. Yeah, the, the second Lothar is always a superior one. Yeah. It seems like that. It really does. It, it, it does because uh, the second Lothar, even if you're like a 10 mana, it takes up half of your mana, mm -hmm. so you use at least something. So you're using something, yeah. Yeah, exactly. and, uh, yeah the, the opponent has to answer somehow, and it's either running Lothar into Lothar if, board, mm -hmm. if there's nothing on the board. So not this hand, right? Right, right, right. Look, 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 at, look at that. Look at right. hand. The spider attacked. There is the, the spider Arach attacked. Arachnid pressure, oh, man. We'll count <laughs> how much damage the spider's going to do. Yeah. Are, you, are, we'll you, count, okay? are you aware about the Chinese water torture? When you like dropping like one drop oh on the oh. uh, on the head every time, it's like a spider. It's like yeah. every turn it's doing one point of damage. You're comparing it, it to water torture, it really. makes you insane. That's annoying. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. The, the only reason, reason this card exists, except for buffing other taker, is to be annoying. Uh, to do nothing. About <laughs> to be the annoying. Average. To do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> to do one damage. Guys, yeah, this confirmed. Okay. Also, like. Uh, Logan, a bit being a professional trade player, what do you think about having double white groups here? Uh, it's not that bad. This eh? one, you should use one right there. No, 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 no. You know why? So you can draw next time. Oh, it's, it's a, it's a card. Right? <laughs> Two mana trade uh, card. Uh, so the best idea with Wargoth ever it was Savitz, who was playing his uh, Ram Druid with uh, Auctioneer. So if he didn't draw the Wargoth early and have for late game. It was like draw three cards. Four cards. Four cards. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, okay. Vago is your. Yeah, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. It yeah. was sick uh, when I saw it for time. It was super clever. Yeah, that was a pretty, yeah, pretty good idea. Alright, so it's a pretty good storm here. Oh, yeah, storm. Yeah. Uh, you can also use Rock Fighter to kill off the um, Spectral Knight as well. So overall. You can use um, Rock Fighter to kill the Spectral uh, Spider that's gonna pop after that. I think so it's annoying, that's good. Cool. Oh yeah, 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 you catch my drift, right? It's like... Yeah. I think Logan would just Earthshock the spider just to... Do, do, yeah, do Earthshock the spider here. Yeah, Earthshock No, it doesn't work the fucking <laughs> everything. <laughs> that's the truth, guys. Logan has spoken. Not worth it, uh, it's, it's really... <coughs> bad card. I don't you, don't, like you don't like it. It's good, but... Doesn't justify a spot in 30 cards. Okay. Okay. For one damage. I mean, it has some synergy, and um, in the the aggro versus aggro games, it, it's, it's really good against good. hunter. Okay, yeah, it's, it's good, good against, against hunter. hunter. So, yeah. it, it, it's good in hunter. And here we go. I oh, understand like your frustration as a trick player. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Rock Fighter here is gonna kill the special. It's gonna be pretty good. Oh, he's gonna battle the egg over four life. Interesting. Because he has the. Um... Flame time. Flame time. Yeah, yeah, so sense. you might get a lot of value, at yeah. least for damage on something. I don't think anybody was summoning a zero tier for four. Sick <laughs> mind games. Oh, oh, that, that. oh, wait, 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 wait. That's actually pretty nice, right? Yeah. Let's see what he draws. He's gonna probably wild growth twice here. Yeah. Remember, guys, Melazic is getting for the victory. That's up. Yes. Another <laughs> this is yeah. the match point. Right? This card is this just is creeping on point. you. <laughs> uh, nice joke. Uh, it's, I hear this card. Oh! Oh wow, wait. So do you love this card now? How much yeah. damage is this? No, I think This is 12 points of yeah. damage. Okay. Just, like, ju just like that. Two fireballs. Two fireballs. Well, spider is so strong. Two fire fireball for free, po free mana. That's pretty good. But uh, I guess. Wait, can you actually use double? Uh, like, kill the Azure Drake with your hero and just deal. What, you kill. A what? You kill the Azure Drake? Yep. Okay. Fire spiders. Yeah. So the spider did five damage now because there's two one times and this is the three now. So five yeah, uh, it's plus a card called Savage Roll. Look at that! That's a Hunter's Creeper! Oh! So it is a oh, good card! Oh, <laughs> oh no, Logan is playing Every, Everybody is playing that. I, okay, Logan, 
Real talk. Are you playing Cottage Creeper in your Druid deck? Are you? No. Of course not. What are you talking about? No. Why would he? Why would he? I, uh, no, no. Okay, he has, okay, he has a card. Okay. Oh, oh, that's I, good. Shot, that's a good one. Earthshock, so the spider dies. This is, is, it, this is it warranted as an Earthshock now? No, it, it doesn't make Logan happy because yeah. it's wa wasting the Earthshock in a card. Okay. Yeah, Earthshock face. Like, or... Logan thinks Earthshock is beneath. Like, it's just. You don't use it on a stupid spider. Okay. It's a spider! <laughs> it's a one dumbass spider, seriously. Oh my god, okay. So, um, it looks like that um, Melassi needs a lot of help here. Sonaris would be a very good draw, right? This is what we've been talking oh, about. Oh, that's, that's the card you want to draw. Okay. Right? That's a real card. But, you have but, lethal, though. Wait, 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 Oh. Uh, I still think it's evil, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's still well, so. Now the question is, if he's going to finish him with the spider as his last card. He doesn't have that spider thing going, so I think it's just finish off of, like, fancy. Uh, oh, the oh, spider gets spider first, first. first. So, guys, yeah, so, so, so what is here? Spiders have dealt <laughs> over 10 damage this game. No. No, it did 5 <laughs> plus 1 to 6. These spiders with summons on did 6 damage in both sides. It's good, it's good. Rogue versus Shaman. Oh man, that change. I think Rogue is favored. <coughs> I think Rogue is favored too. The standard Miracle Rogue is favored against Shaman yep. if you get a Gadget Sand. If you don't get a Gadget Sand, it's really tricky, but you can still win. Well, that's a hack. May, may I ask something, Vim? I guess which deck Miracle is favorable ho without Gadzan? Drip. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, um, you got challenged. I think you're speechless. Are you, are you okay, it's, a, it, it's tough, yeah. I mean, you really <laughs> need to go aggro. Right. Uh, but it's like 50 50. Okay. Oh, you need Gadzan. Yeah, you, you need, you, if, you, if you need Gadzan, you're favorable for sure. But uh, okay. if you don't. And you can go aggro on Druid and use saps uh, because if you don't gadget sand, you basically throw the, the other stuff. Well, uh, I think now they lose to Druid without gadget sand causes to take it on Spiral Oh, yeah, you're right. You're Are right. you making fun of Raynat never drawing a gadget sand auction here ever? Maybe. No, we'll I mean, see. We'll see when it comes. I'm, I won't be surprised if he just doesn't play it. Yeah, it's uh, because not he never draws it anyway, so he's like... Okay, just go back. Wait, yeah. so, so Reynard actually switched to Rogue? No. Oh, uh, no, Reynard's getting Tro out of it. Okay. Troll Tro didn't just troll us. It's a nastic playing the Rogue. Okay. Really? No, 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 look at the blue, <laughs> look at the look blue at thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I checked the names before the overlay come out. Oh, no. No, I don't think you checked enough. No. <laughs> it's okay, we're all getting tired. Look at the blue. Oh, 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 look at the blue. What's happening? Oh, 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 so Reyna switched his shaman deck it's two on, uh, into a rogue, and this two is on. this is Gadget Reyna's rogue. This is Miracle Rogue with Sludge Belcher. Okay, with Black Knight okay. as well, and Leroy, and Leroy, there and Leroy. I mean, Black Knight. We've been talking about it a little bit. That this card has been really popular in a lot of decks because I Sludge Belcher, this. Sludge Belcher has been played everywhere. Well, a four five to deal five damage. Do you, do you think that Black Knight is a good answer to Sludge Belcher? I mean. I wouldn't say it's a good answer, but it's a fair it's answer. It's yeah. decent. It's decent. So it adds value it's when you go against a more taunts. Yeah. Like a, a, a deck that runs Ascension, it suddenly becomes really good. Yeah. But if it's just Belchers, I don't know. I'm not really sold on it. Yeah. It's uh, not like it's the Sun Walker, like all the times. It's not Sun Walker. Yeah, when you. Use, like Black Knight is uh, Sun Walker 9% win a game. Yeah, you do. Yeah. By the way, this this play is just uh, amazing for sure. You five. get Unbound and you, you kill uh, it's good. a 3 mana creature for like uh, for 1 mana with Lightning Bolt. Oh, Plus actually, you buff up your suit. I mean, so, so far, 10 cards. Reyna has not drawn Auction, okay? 10 cards. That might be actually pretty sad. Oh, oh, is that like the super play? The Lothab. The Lothab the Lothab. That's the Lothab play. Lothab, 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 Lothab. But then you're against a miracle roll, you kinda wanna play it when there's a gadget on yeah. concealed, right? I yes. know. I think you can clear I don't know. <coughs> hmm. You I think you have I have to play flame tongue here. Yeah, the flame tongue here? Yeah. 
Why did it, why did it play Flying Dutch? It doesn't matter. It's gonna shift, I guess, right? Mm. That's so weird. I uh, maybe he just just doesn't want to take damage from Miracle Rogue because he I knows he has a lot of damage. You can like so Argus uh, with go face, but like Defender of Argus. Well, even face Argus and Trade is not that bad. It, it, not even Trade. Are you gonna Trade? Okay. This is a little annoying. Maybe. Yeah, that, the, yeah, the positioning is kind of a good totem. It's a totem, it's a good totem. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, like, you really want to keep Lothad against the Miracle. Can he actually kill There is a God's stand. Oh! Guys, there's still hope. Reyna, oh. Reyna can actually make a comeback. Reyna, Reyna wins this tournament. What? He just wins it. He's he wins the that. tournament. Yeah, the tournament. The tur wow. Because this never happened. You heard it here first. Oh, that's kind of a dead card. If you would, if you wouldn't get this gadget son, this game would be so face. sad. But right but now he actually has face. a chance. Of course you have to shift face. Yeah, but it's, told him it's so annoying. Oh, but still. Oh, this is huge. The dream yeah. is still alive. Well, because there's Lotha, playing this preparation now is super important. He gets three draws here. That's Four. one. Deadly poison is good because okay. he, has blade he gets blade. another two three. Yeah, blade, that, blade fury. That looks Deadly really poison good. and blade fury. I mean, perfect. He still has a chance to get a conceal. But even if he has a conceal, then there's no that. Don't feel? Don't let them know? Definitely don't let them know. And now you know. No. And, and, now, now, and now you, you know. know. Wow. 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 <coughs> you, you called it. You called it. But it's wait. so cold. I so mean, I guess Melazic has to let it go now. Um, Melazic can play Totem up now, so it's 50-50. I'm getting <laughs> It's 50-50 on both, so it's I guess both. you just yeah, it's like low fat. Yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, like, it's I don't know. See, there you go. Bad Jordan. You're trying to make the Lazic lose, right? Because oh you're a great fanboy. Oh my god, that game just... Like, that's why I hate Vilani Rose. He's like... Let's draw a lot of it. Okay. We play it at the same time. Well, the cards are not that good if you don't draw all of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But if you draw all of them, like, it's think, like... Think about preparation, like, the card is just bad. Yeah, it you is. Just, you just lose the card. Well, it's innervate. It's a better innervate. It's better innervate. It's crazy. Well, uh, that's only for spells. Well, yeah, I know. I don't know. Like, like, any card that br gets extra mana is kind of OP in my opinion. Do you play? You need to be very careful. Do you play far side on your summon? You don't gain mana in far side. You yeah. spend three for three, so it's not really a gaining. It's a net zero, right? So that's the problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. <coughs> okay, so back here. Um, what do you do here? I guess you have to. Um, you have to deal with the auctioneer somehow. Oh, he he rolled it all in to get a spell damage. That's one. not a spell damage. So I guess you do lightning storm and then finish um. the leftovers, but it's kind of sad. So maybe actually... if you are if you gonna storm, why you are shock first? Mm. Oh yeah, that's weird, right? Yeah, that is weird. Maybe maybe you can just hex the auctioneer. It it, yeah, it was a bit too fast, I think. It was wait, a bit wait, premature. Right. So, whoa, so, you, whoa, whoa. so you do air shock the auctioneer for sure, or do you, do you just kill it? I mean, well, this I is mean, so what's insane. happening. Reynard's uh, gonna get it. I think Malazi is think it's moving before he thought of his whole move. Yeah. Like even like he's kind of confused right now. So yeah, I think he's. A... Yeah, I think he just lost. Stuff. There are two opposites. Like Malazi. Alright, so does let's see if this real highs. Malazi just does stuff and Reynard. Oh, oh, that's a low roll, man. Wow. It's this. It doesn't matter. He's gonna trade both totems. Oh yeah, I guess. No, but... he can trade the second totem. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah it actually matters. Like because he can't air shock it now. But I guess you just go face and pass. You have to... seven damage. Yeah, you have to attack face. Seven damage. <laughs> yeah, just kind of attack it to the free too. I think it would be oh, too devastating if you traded. Yeah, but that was unlucky. I mean, but um, then again, his sequencing was that kind of weird. His sequencing was kind of yeah. So it's pretty easy, right? I mean, you just. Poison, Flurry, SI. Yeah. Looks six. pretty easy. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, you actually play all your hand now, except you It's pretty it. natural play. Oh, but right? still, like, you don't do it really fast. You have to think about all the plays. Okay. You have a lot of cards, you have a lot of mana. Okay, you uh, can, like, dagger up, chop yourself. Uh, no, I don't see another. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's not obvious. Really. You have to think about it. Really? Possible. It's not obvious. Okay. I see Ekop behind Reynard, trying to give him like the mojo. Oh, there is Ekop actually, yeah. Yeah, Ekop giving the mojo, man. Did, did they think like you SI7 face, your face? Like, is it the Ekop play? Okay. Ekop's trying to like SI7 uh, uh, Reynard. By the way, this is the, the, the Reynard uh, signature move. Like every time he's uh, having a really tough turn, mm -hmm. uh, playing a Miracle Rogue, he's always going to rope and then 
He starts acting with the rope, says. He wants to Oh my god, he actually acted before the rope. I'm, Wait, what? I'm surprised. Maynard keeps improving every time. Wait, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. You, Maybe you so he wants to use the um, uh, choppy choppy, right? Yeah, the MS race Okay. I mean, that makes sense. That makes sense because of uh, Spell Spirit. So you keep the flurry because there's only. Oh, well, he is playing only <coughs> one fan of knives. Mm -hmm. So he does respect the, the power okay, so of there was another spirit. play. Okay, good yeah. job. Whoa, oh, and he's job. overloaded. He does, doesn't have the ability to play no. like right now. So this 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 uh, kind of sucks. Nope, yeah, that's not the totem you're looking for. He's still looking for a spell damage out of, mm. but it's not coming. No, I don't think that's all. Sure is so useless right now. That's, that just shows well, did you the like quality. This, this well, you have to play something. Yeah, you, you're something, you're yes. so behind right now. Yeah, this is what I was saying that the uh, quality of um, Lassic's hand it, it shows right now that he couldn't play anything. Yeah. So he either has reactional cards or he was overloaded, so he couldn't play something like Alakir, for example. Because Alakir would be really great that turn. Yeah, it would be really. Now great. I see a funny play. Like um, you play Leroy and then you no. let you use you play play play? Okay. And then attack for like twelve. And then you shot a shot of stuff. Okay. Can you even weapon up after that? You can't. Okay. Well, well you okay. can't. Wait, you can't weapon up after that because you have nine mana. Yeah. So, so that's that's pretty great. I, I like that. Too. I think if he really gonna play Blade Fury, he should at least hit once with Leroy. Yeah. It cancels drawback, and you, you won't use all your mana. Yeah. Anyway. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And you have five, you need to be creative. Maybe <coughs> he's scared of something like I like you with double rock beater and I don't know. Really? Yeah, it's the only reason to play Bells as well. I think he is scared. And I uh, rightfully so, I mean they not had a bad RNG in some of his games and he just Yeah, but if you're it. playing super safe sometimes you're just losing because of that. Yeah. Like you're losing the opportunity. Oh my oh. god. Yes. Okay. So safe. That's really, really safe. I should give him credit for that play, though. I mean, I I respect it. Okay. Because playing safe is sometimes oh. the best card in the game. Best card in the game. Best card in the game. Confirm. Ch so what is? And it's actually you can actually deal four <laughs> points of damage. And, here. and you know what you actually do here? You uh, you just earth shock hex hex and just play Doomer. Just play a hand, mm -hmm. and you just like go in, and then you might win next turn. That's so sick. You might win next yeah. turn. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my! What just happened? Are you serious? You're, really? You're not playing safe. Like, what? What? Why would you do that? He would have done six damage. Oh, okay, he's like how six plus six. It's twelve. It's twelve. So I guess it's not lethal, but still, I'm not happy. Yeah, about I don't. That. I don't. I'm like not happy. Yeah, I don't I mean, like why? Why is okay on the side? For... Yeah, exactly. I go that. I'm not really. It happy doesn't change anything. That. So you're yeah. not playing to win. You're playing to to not lose. That, not even, like because. Oh, not even. No. I mean, okay, no, not not lose. Well, not like, lose, but then the thing is that you need to win the game. Yeah. yeah. Eventually, I, you I, have I, to I, get the moment skip points to zero. Oh man, I don't really like that player. I think Reynard got this. I think Reynard got this too. Especially after that um, airshot being wasted. Yeah, it was really bad there, so. I mean, okay, just it's fine here. Yeah. Don't, don't. I think attack. I tap into one of the wells, so, though, right? No, 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 no. no. So Logan, space, space, why do you attack here? That's on a okay. scale from okay. air shocking um, haunted creeper and um, like air everyone aside, which one? <laughs> b b like that's hard. Let me think about it. Okay. I don't know. I think the earth shock is just worst. Yeah, this earth hands down. Yeah. I think the earth shock is okay, just worst. Yeah. Yeah, I think this was really bad. No, I mean it was. <laughs> <laughs> I call it. I call it. <laughs> Oh my god. Best card of the game. Oh no. Okay. It does one damage per turn. Wait, now he can actually clear this. Okay. Yeah. Um, oh wow. Yep. Wait, wait, wait. This this is this wait, actually looks weird. Is this lethal? No no no, uh, wait, for for whom? Oh, for, <laughs> no, for the wrong, for the wrong. For the wrong. <laughs> I for Reynard. don't um, think so. It's like, no, 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 he doesn't have the shadow step. Oh, oh wait. He, he, plays, he plays weapon attacks, then plays flurries. It's done the Oh, 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 yeah, that is a yeah, card. Wait, wait, wait. Can he, can, she, can he, like, no, he can't play everything. That's not a haunted creature. I guess it's just. Yeah. 
One guy, Tom Dix, Hunt Creeper. Other guy, Tom Dix, uh, Black Knight. Who is better? <laughs> <laughs> it's fun. It's it is better. Wait, wait, wait. So you you just switch you switch hunting creepers to black knight and savannas. Even to war golem. Okay. Harvest golem, right? Okay. No, war golem. A war golem. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wow. Seven, seven, nine. So the black knight comes down. Alakir is dead. And what's happening here? I guess you attack with you weapon attack, and refresh it. Rep rep yeah. You don't even play the deadly poison, just in case. Just in case. In case. In case of uh, Harrison Jones, I, I, I guess something I think like Harrison that. Jones. As oh, a trick is, is that a good card? If he top decks like not uh, really. One, uh, <laughs> the if, thing is, like, if he if he actually does like a totem, Skittles and uh, Argus, he's dead. Because there's uh, play flurry. Mm -hmm. Oh, he doesn't. I think he's dead. No, hey, I don't think. Here comes the big card. I don't think there was oh, something no. that could have saved him. Like, what, just Azric and Argus was not enough? Well, you know, it wasn't enough you can't play around the Fairy all the time, yeah. so... <coughs> well, that Urshak was pretty disappointing, I think. Yeah, yeah let's was... see how much value this spider gonna get. Uh-oh. What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <Zero>. <laughs> what? No! What? Oh my god, zero? This card did nothing! Oh, man. Raina Logan's, is gonna Logan's clean true. up the... Wait, Wait he wins. He, he has the right? Yeah, 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 obviously. Okay. Yeah. Raina, do you see it? <laughs> it's really hard to miss it. Okay, actually. okay. So let, let, let's not misclick. Uh, I, I, I don't think he, I don't think he can attack himself with a B one, so he will win this game. Oh, oh BM! Oh, that's the BM, the backstab into Lira. So you mentally damage your opponent for the last game of this series. Oh wow! Oh uh, man! This is what we It's like about. having two oh, man. creepers. We get the Rogue versus War as our last match now. That's a fun match. And he has Auctioneer. He has Auctioneer. That's super important. He just okay. skips it. Like, of course. Yeah, I win. Like, he's so slow. Does Mel Melaza play... Uh, ooh. They also Faceless. We don't see that card uh, <coughs> often here. Well, some Warriors still, uh, are still playing it. Some Warriors, yeah. Okay. Um, oh, so that's the hand after the Mulligan. That's the hand after the Mulligan. Yeah, okay. Oh my god. The Belgium's gonna be pretty good. I mean, they both have pretty good hands, let's be honest. Okay? Yeah, I say 7 is a pretty good card to have. I mean, the best draw right now would be like something like an Acolyte or something, you know. Armor Smith, the two drops. Yeah, he wants the like the small drops. Ah, yeah, okay, whatever. It's, he's not that sad about it. I mean, the, the thing is, like, Rogue has a limited no number of, of damage exactly, like, yeah, that he yeah. can deal. So, Warrior can just armor up as much as possible. Answer the threats when they appear, mm -hmm. and, and then try to execute his uh, his combo, which is Alexstrasza into Grom, or just maybe okay. build up the board. Such Butch is a pretty important card uh, in this matchup as well because it's hard to deal with. Mm -hmm. you, you sometimes have to stop it. Uh, do, do you find it? I think actually, it's a pretty I, easy fan. I think you find it. I think it's a pretty easy fan. Yeah, it's fun. They're against like, the you know, warrior, most fans of times, sucks. Yeah, most of the time you don't want to use. Uh, yeah, because of like, 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 yeah, yeah, so many yeah. stuff. Right. But uh, belts, I like Belzer um, this much up because if you play Belzer ten five and get up, next day you play like uh, Kevin Silvanas. You have so many big threads okay. that you Rod just can't use subs on uh, Belzer. So I think the warrior has the advantage. Yeah, after yeah. that enough, yeah. Also, also like seeing that um, he has running Unstable and he didn't play Unstable he is keeping it. That was a pretty good play as well. Like, you want to armor up as much as possible mm -hmm. with night damage, and you want to keep Unstable Ghoul for like some, Ooh, some importers. Oh, Rag is so good against Miracle. Rag is really good. Because rag is really, really good. If they sap it, like, when you play Rag, there's an immediate eff effect. Like, yeah. they always hit something. Mm -hmm. If they sap it, it just returns. Oh, man. And if they kill it, it tanks eight points of eight points of damage, yeah. damage, and it it's dealt like eight point, points. Of damage. I believe that the uh, miracle was super strong before the Leroy nerf against Warrior because he could do so much damage. Terrix was much. It was so much burst. Yeah, even yeah. even without Assassin's Blade, it uh -huh. was still a yeah, good matchup. The reach was really high, but now the, they just can kill a Warrior. Okay, that makes because sense. of all the taunts and stuff, like yeah. Flash Belcher. No, no, that it's. That you are you always dying for like twenty five hit points or something. <coughs> now you, they can't read that. Like two turns, right? Yeah, two it, turns, and that's two, turns. too slow, right? Two turns is, means well, one extra six, mana for one extra six block and kill power. Okay. Seven hit points. Black Knight! Oh my God! He gets he gets a black. Oh knight. my! Oh, oh you don't, yes. that's a swing. 
I've ever seen one. The and pleasure I, I, is his And, his and his I, just oh I just wanted, I just wanted to to praise wow. Mlas Mlasic that he saved uh, one point of health from Sad Virtue, so that Reyna won't be able to eviscerate. But that Black Knight was just a huge draw. That's still better than Hound Creeper. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> okay, let's be serious. You're not playing Hunter Creeper in a murder Well, you might. Why? Just one damage. One, one damage every turn. Oh man, maybe. That's what you said. Maybe, it's like, maybe sure. Maybe sure. It's like I seeing me go right? every turn without the uh, draw card. Yeah. Well, anyways, here we have a uh, execute. execute, and then we probably have an armor up. That, that was a pretty obvious execute because yeah, 40 that, health that, is I mean, still something. Yeah, but that, that, that black knight was super good. Like 40 health is still something. You deal 5 points of damage and you put a 4 5 minion on board. It's like a 5 elemental on crack. Yeah. What do you guys think about Reynard's miracle deck in general? It doesn't have cold blood, right? Uh, I don't so he has to find damage from some some creative way. Oh, look, there's Connecto I mean, in the background oh. eating apples. Okay. Yeah, I think this is why Reynard's winning. like past again because Colinto was somewhere there oh. with his spirit. Colinto is still there, so is he going to draw something amazing with a chef? Not really. No. That was the I don't Ah uh, that's reasonable. I don't like this option here. I, I I have you you have to shadow step it, right? Uh, yeah, I, I mean if you shadow step you lose so much damage. You lose yeah. so much damage. It's I like know but I fought, you treat a fireball. For a three mana four four, but you also like moving your creature. Yeah, yeah. but now it's oh, like... Oh, it's dead. No. All right, we see we see the um deckless here, but then we know what they play already. I mean, it's pretty obvious. I'm pretty surprised that it's not an RDU deckless. Yeah, I don't see it. Okay. Wow. Shots fired. No. I, I would actually. I'll say... Oh wait, the, the, the warrior list, by the way, is Sarah. So it's like <laughs> really, uh, yeah. it, it's yeah. kind of pretty. also like her and faceless. So what do you do here? Um, I mean, I guess you want to kill Sylvanas, but then at the same time you kill Sylvanas, that's like a five health, that's five, five damage. That's, that's that you a magical never number. Back. That's the magical number of five magic health. It's, it's really hard to to deal with. Them. Well, it's not that magical because you have SI, but with Sylvanas's effect, it is quite magical. I mean, what, yeah, so what, what do you do then? You lose the SI. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's quite magical. She like attack into her and then kill her with, with face. face. With face. Oh, with an face. You do so much damage. And then, yeah, I mean, I know. And then you play like a scion, a first, first year. Can you even do that? No, she didn't yes. have that. Yes. I, I, I just play one of it. Yeah, yeah, well, I just one. I was just asking the question because like I'm not a super professional player, but uh, I haven't seen that many miracle rogues in the tournament recently. Okay. And um, the what I saw a different cards in it. And Reynard's one looks like uh, the, the typical Miracle Rock that everyone played before. Yeah. The before the Lear enough. It's yeah. like he didn't get the news. Yeah, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like, wait, what? It's fine? <laughs> <laughs> Something goes wrong here. Something is not right, does it? He's still playing around. Bobby. Yeah, I mean, 40 health. 40 health. Yeah, I mean, it looks so... super good for Melastic. Yeah, hmm. and it looks it looks good. Maybe uh, Ragnar was turn. It's I'm a pretty good Ragnar was turn. I mean, winning somehow. I, I'd imagine winning this game would be playing something and then cold blooding in two times. Yeah, cold blood is, yeah, exactly. So you get extra mileage. But that Reyna doesn't card. have double cold blood. Yeah, oh, he he gets the second auction here. So okay. now he will. Uh, this is actually a huge drop because he, because he will be able to yeah. drop it. Auction your sap is pretty sweet. Play, play sap. But then the, the Ragnar is just coming back. No, you still back. have two preparations. Like, where are they, you know? You just kind of want to find them. And it's two last cards. Two last cards. Yeah, the, the preparations are not here. But now you're demanding too much. You're demanding you draw auctioneer and preparation. Also, he's That's running out of that, like, out of damage. I mean, how much damage can he deal? Mm, uh, still enough. It's like six. Well, not cold blood. It is quite hard. Yeah, and he doesn't run cold blood. He doesn't uh, run sinister strike. Mm, yeah. he is running black knight though. A lot of people wanted to substitute uh, some stuff to add in cold bloods mm -hmm. because it's not as easy to call uh, the shadow step we were right now and get. Yeah, that it's really damage. difficult. Most yeah. people remove shadow steps. Wait, is he going to just spawn the board with minions? Whoa. Yeah. Or maybe he's going. Oh, he's actually going to kill it, and he's going to attack it. Oh, he's going to use one of the. Oh, he's going to use one of the shadow steps. Oh, nice. No. Yeah, but then, like, That's he's, not nice. I mean, he's, it's nice that he kills Ragnaros without taking damage, but on the other hand, he lost, he lost so much damage. So oh, he's no. going to it out he's of not going to win at yeah, this point. How, how are you going to kill the warrior now? I don't like this point. You won't go in the warrior. I, I, I realize it's kind of like. It's, it no. seems like a smart play. 
It's not playing for the win. It's, it's not playing for the win. It's playing it's not to play, lose. Explain to lose in five yeah. turns or so. Like you kind of like bleeding, right? You kind of like bleeding. It, it, like the, the ship is sinking and it's on fire. No. You put out the fire, but it's still sinking. Yeah. You have to like take that. a chance. And just break through all the doors and go out. Yeah, you know? it's like someone shot you with an arrow and you need to get somewhere, but yeah. you just take all the arrows. Oh wow, he's got a lot of shadow stab. Look at that. Oh my god, you're gonna shot are you gonna like shadow step it again? <laughs> well we play we play gotcha stand and you shadow step it and you hope that you have forty mm. cards in your deck. Oh no, it's not it's not looking nah, good. Uh, actually forty with three cops with Leroy. You actually hope that this is not the Leroy deck, but the Malagos deck, and Malagos and Sinister Strikes are still there. No, yeah, Malagos is actually like I would prefer that over this right now. Yeah, like over yeah, the Leroy. Yeah, well. But um, looking at this right now, do you Leroy, and then use the S use S I R dagger to trade so the wolf dies with the explosion and you shot stuff <laughs> the Leroy back. I guess you can. <laughs> nice plan. <laughs> no, no, but like, he'll draw a card out of it. Oh, oh, man. Man. oh, he's actually going for it. Oh my yeah, god. I, so, yeah. I mean, it makes sense, right? But Is there still, any it's... any value in playing Gadgets right now? Mm, it's any value really right? Oh man, this is Good so question. painful to watch. I mean, I think I think Reina just like conceded the game when he when he did that play. I still think he would have lost it. He would have. No, he would have. You know, it's really bad for him, but. With this play, he's like lost for sure, right? That's yeah, he I doesn't have enough that. power to be able yeah, to just like block the warrior. Yeah, like you lose for sure. And he already used so much damage on the Sylvanas, so much damage on the Rag. And so, it's so sad um, that he uses Shadow Step like without Gadget Sound on the board because he doesn't have that many spells, so he can... Uh, like, in theory, he might play Gadget Sun and then sap something in order to draw... Oh, it's Zera! He got a Zera! And there's like oh no... Yeah, that's played uh, straight forward. Just Zera execute, yeah. right? I mean... Uh, is Zera execute and attack with Acolyte. Uh, <coughs> oh, well, yeah. I mean, how is a, how is a rogue gonna do 26 damage in one turn? With, <laughs> with three cards in hand? Wait, what, one shadow step used on an SI. The, and one shadow step used... One shadow used already. So it's like, you can all... all Oh my god, like, even if there's double cold blood, it's like 14 points of damage, yeah, that's it's, it. It's too much. Wow, he's keeping it execute. So you just slap. Okay. Maybe um, there's like a slap to or something. I'm not sure though, like, what, what, what do you use execute for? Whatever. I mean, Broucher, or like a big point. Oh wait, admin. Oh. That might be like, good, I, I guess. If you top decks preference. No, 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 this game is over. Like, look how, ma look how many cards yeah. actually... But that's, that's, that's why you can't execute. I got the awakening! That's why you can't execute. Awakens, yeah. Is there the, the thing is, like, you don't even need it. You can just go and awakenings, and it's the same thing too. Yeah, awakenings does monster. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Like you have a lot of choices, huh? Oh, and yeah, to add in. Just in case. Yeah, just in case. Just in case, case. something goes wrong. Love that. It's here. And brawl is here. Love that, okay. boys. I wonder uh, if there's like a cool play with faces here, but uh, I guess after. No, you can't. You, you kill as well, right? Yeah, you can. So do you like? Just kill this guy with a Pick Master. Pick your poison. Yeah. Which one do you want? Which one do you want? Oh, the one? Sure. Wait, what's the follow-up? Whatever you want. Do, can you like faces this? Are you really? Are you really scared of follow-ups in this position? No, oh, okay. You just really? sound both up. You're, you're good. Okay, I'm out. Use, use your imagination. Okay. If you want to be great out here, if you want to come back. I wanted to use my imagination, but I saw a deckless. Okay. I, I got you, man. It showed a death list, so no, no imagination, I'm afraid. So like, now, yeah, now you just prolong the game. Yeah, we know I... there is no hand. Oh, there's... Oh, look at the deck list. Oh, look at the, the deck list. They're teasing us. We know what the deck lists are, but... Now, a deck could probably there's win There's no card in the rogue deck that can save him in this position. There's no way. There is no card that can... Like, well, from Warrior's deck that would have saved Rogue. still has like, a second backstab, I guess. Wow. Grats, are you gonna do... <laughs> 70, 70 double space for the bike. Well, you can trade with Lothab. Oh no. I mean, yeah, trade, right? Because that was the plan from the get go. Because oh, when you play me, you can trade stuff. Like, uh, imagine, like, he, he wasted 7 the... damage on Sylvanas and 8 damage on Ragnaros. No, actually, not even 8, because he shadow stepped in SI, so that's like oh, a possible yeah. more. So is there a question? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, sure, okay. He definitely had the chance. So, what do you say now? <laughs> Good game plan. I, you just say I bring one. Just throw Sera. Yeah, for this, this game is over. Like, when with one card and the weapon. It's painful to watch. I, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure. Reynas that have zero damage left. I mean, mm -hmm. it's everything like... Uh, yeah, like backstab and stuff. Backstab, yeah. uh, preparation. One stuff. more sap. One more sap. 
Yeah. Uh, why did play Alex Tazas of uh, Isara here? I think he just like... It doesn't really matter. Okay, he has shift, that's one point of damage. Yeah, it's one yeah, point. Yeah, it's like a hot creep uh, hit. <laughs> Oh, oh preparation no. finally Are you saying that ship is like... Oh, he still has a second preparation in, in his deck. You can prep a prep. <coughs> Why are you prepping? Look, I was kidding. I was kidding when I said that preps are two last cards. Oh, yeah. You know what? I, I actually feel sorry for Reyna because... It, it, uh, to be honest... Making, he's making correct plays. No, wait. Don't you be honest? I don't, no, think... I don't know about correct, but to be honest, it's really hard for a rogue to be a warrior from Assassin's Blade. Yeah. If you're running the normal one. Right. To be fair, also especially I wouldn't. I wouldn't culture. say the correct play. No, I wouldn't. Oh, you mean like the Ragnaros scaling play? Yeah, was not correct? I, I'm not really sold on the. You just can't win from that point. You just lost so much. Yeah, 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 but he was like behind anyway. Like the uh, before. Yeah, the so Ragnaros. you have to take a risk, right? And um, you just attack with it. You just, you just can't. Oh man, yeah, that's you it. can't even Sudoku. Oh man, this is like, Mlasek is the first yeah, qualified, first qualified yeah. player who actually advances to the top 8.